Hello all, welcome back to Let's Play Wozhack. This one is episode 2 and hopefully it's going to go a little bit better than the absolutely abysmal episode 1. As I've said before, I usually play as the knight, but today I think I'm going to go with the Valkyrie, because as far as I know, she's basically the same as the knight, statistically. I haven't trolled through the statistics, but look at them, they're all in pairs, so it makes sense. Um, and also I'm kind of sick of the knight, his stupid blonde mullet that enrages and disgusts me. Alright, so we're Elise the Rebel. We have our usual dog that actually looks a little bit like a velociraptor there, with excessively long front arms. Anyway, down we go. Yes, I just said front arms, like there's any other kind. The well-known rear arm of the velociraptor. Anyway, let's grab this gem, head to the right. As usual, we have a bit of basic kit, a bit of armour, an axe, no shield or anything. Uh, oh no, actually we do have a shield, so we may want to consider developing our shield skill as we go along. Picking lots of scrolls. Scrolls, of course, can be powerful in any roguelike, or at least any roguelike that I've played, but in Wozhack, they can also be very, very, very dangerous. And because there aren't really distinct floors as such, um, my usual approach of clearing out a floor and then using it when I'm pretty much... using a scroll when I'm pretty much safe to test what it is, doesn't really work. So I'm going to just try it here before we get too far in. What was that? Teleportation. Fine. Incidentally, if you can hear a humming in the background, hopefully Audacity's noise removal feature will get rid of it, but if you can, it's the oven. I'm cooking a pizza. Yum! Delicious pizza. Alright, let's read this one. Okay, that, that set my armour on fire. Which means I'm almost dead. Look at the state of my health! Got almost no health left. Oh, God. Alright, well, I'm going to sleep, and hopefully... That will counter the effect of the fire. Yep. I thought I might burn even faster than I was healing, but it worked out. Let's try one more scroll since we're here. But this is kind of the point. So it does still sort of work in this. Using um, unknown scrolls and potions when you're not being beset by enemies. I mean, imagine if I'd set myself on fire and gone down to almost no health when there were enemies nearby. Disaster! Right, let's read Zelgomer scroll. Nothing happens. Right, so that could be anything. Okay, kill this thing while it's on the ladder. Come on! Ugh. Quite how I hit it from, you know, past my feet. I don't know. Kill the cabbage. Alright, grab myself a green gem. Don't want the crude dagger. Uh, that looks like a potion. Yeah. So let's drink that. Hit Q to quaff. Here we go. Emerald potion. Potion of fruit juice. Well, that's not the most exciting potion you could possibly imagine. Alright, I'm not going to test out the other potion until I've killed this shit. Grab a wand and a cyan potion. Not bothered about the short sword. But again, test out my potions. Potion of monster detection. Um, so it says over here on the left, you sense a kobold and you sense a sewer rat. I don't know how long the effects last, if at all. Potion of fireproofing. Could have done with that a couple of minutes ago, but never mind. Shall we test the wand? Yeah, why not? Oh, we need to aim it at something. Oh, nice aiming system. Look, I even point it sort of back over my shoulder. That's quite a ni nice touch. I'm stammering over my words slightly today because I'm nervous. Not about this, but about the fact that I'm hosting a pub quiz tonight for the first time. Filling in for the regular quiz master, so wish me luck. Although by the time you see this, it'll be over, so... Wish me luck in a retconning kind of fashion. Alright, I'm going to stop trying out all these items, because it's slowing me down. I want to actually get on with some dungeon crawling at some point. Maybe I'll even find a weapon or some armour. At the moment it's mainly reading material, which is kind of anticlimactic when you're trawling a dungeon, really. All right. More potions. Kill the thing! I think it was a bat. Was that a bat? Yes. Bats in all games! Duh. Alright, taking some damage, so I should be careful. I might want to heal up in a minute. Aha, a book. Probably not intelligent enough to use it, but we can try. That was the wrong one. There we go. Read the book, and if we're lucky, we might be able to learn a spell from it. With great difficulty, you learn levitation. Excellent. Um, and I think I can actually... Yeah, I still have the book, so I can actually sell it if we find a shopkeeper. So that's a nice feature. Hmm. Alright, in a minute I will actually take that Warhammer and take a look at it. But first level up. 
I could dual wield. Why the hell not? Yeah. Right, so, and another level immediately. Do you see what I mean? From what I've mentioned in previous videos about the weird-ass rate of levelling up. Alright, um, let's add another level to dual wielding, shall we? There we go, good stuff. Let's grab this hammer. And then we can probably equip um, the Warhammer as well. Wield. Oh, it's cursed, but that's alright. At least it's another weapon. Oh, maybe I need to unequip the shield as well. Alright, so let's find the shield, take off, and then... Well, don't want a minus two morning star, so let's wield our original axe again, shall we? I don't want to unwield my warhammer, I want to wield it in my other hand. Okay, there we go. I was just using the wrong menu. Right, pick up this food. I'm not bothered about kobold innards, but an apple might be useful. We'll probably get hungry quite soon. Okay, um, I think we've done with this floor. Oh no, there's a door still. And a cabbage. Not bothered about the cabbage. Grab a scroll. Yep. What's that? Is that a potion? Jade ring. Hmm. It's probably nothing, but I'll try it on in case it's something good. Alright, lots of scrolls again, so let's... Um, scroll enchant weapon. Okay. The cursed warm hammer is surrounded by a golden glow. Does that mean it's not cursed anymore? Let's try. Yes! Ah, oh, that's nice. But actually, I want to wield it anyway, so... Let's continue. Um, what about the other scroll? Two of those. Oh, it's a scroll of identify, so I can identify an item. Let's identify this jade ring, see if it's magic. Uncursed ring of magic regeneration. Yeah! And we get to identify another item. I think you get to identify two each time. Let's identify our blessed long wand, which sounds like an innuendo. Long wand of death. Okay. Seven charges. Fine. Kill that. Alright, so that's all good stuff. Let's put on that regeneration ring, because it'll regenerate our magic. We're not using any magic at the moment, but it certainly can't hurt to have it regening. Let's hit rest, because we're down to less than half health. We'll probably be hungry pretty soon. Um, yeah, actually, there's a little food icon up there, in the top left, under our picture. So, that indicates that we're hungry. So let's scoff that apple. That's the only food we have. Pretty soon, we might have to resort to actually eating corpses and things. Let's see if we can pick up any rat corpse. No. Bat corpse? No. Okay, we might have to eat some goblin then. Whoa! Okay, there's lots of crap lying around here. Let's take the skull cap, the potions, the wand. None of these weapons, not bothered about any of them. There we go. No meat, unfortunately. But I will put on the helmet. There we go. Yeah. Wait, AC minus five. Why? Oh, God. It's a minus five skullcap. Take it off. Oh, it's cursed. And I don't have um, an enchant thing. I just have an identify, so I can't uncurse it. Oh, all right. Maybe this will be one. Identify again. Well, they're good. They're certainly good, but um, not quite what I'm after right at the moment. Gain a level. Let's go with... What does Nightmare Mode do? Ugh. More damage, but more experience. No, I'm not hardcore enough for that. You detect blessing, curse, or enchantment of an item every one... Sorry, every two minutes. That could be good. Let's buy that. Sounds like it's passive, and it um, detects magic effects of items periodically. Alright, let's grab all this stuff. Chainmail suit could be good. Uh, so let's take that. Piss off, bat. Okay. So, let's use one of the scrolls of identify to identify the chainmail. Oh, it's cursed. Well, at least that's good in a way. I was about to just put it on, so that was uh, a good use of that scroll there. Okay, down to almost no health. So, better grab jackal meat, ruby potion, vellum spellbook. Not bothered about the rest of this crap. 
So, now before I do anything else, I'm going to rest, get my health back. Rest until healed, yes. You're weak from hunger. Okay, better eat some jackal meat. Okay, now do some more resting. Might become hungry again in a minute. But I need the rest, need the health. Beginning to feel hungry. Well, I don't have any food, but I'd better leave it there at about half health. So I don't get any hungrier. Let's read the vellum spell book. You stop reading. Uh, okay. Alright, I'll use Identify on it then, shall I? Where is it? There it is. Uncursed Spellbook of Clean Wounds. Oh, that could be useful. Maybe I don't have the ability to learn that spell yet. With great difficulty you learn it. Good. So I'm actually learning some spells here. That's an improvement over the last time, at least. Alright. Uh... Okay, let's go over to the right here. Another book. Man, I'm getting a lot of reading material here. Alright, let's try reading that one. Come on, read, read. Oh, you stopped reading because a goblin barges in. You have no respect for the arts. Alright, read it. Read it. Oh, get back. What's wrong with you lot? Bunch of Philistines. Read. It was too advanced. Fine. That's absolutely fine, I don't really mind. So now I'm confused for a bit. I'm not sure what effect that has, but it's certainly not going to be good. That looks like a wizarding hat. Yeah, no use for that. Slightly hungry, uh, but I don't have any food handy. Oh god, another book! I don't think I've ever picked up this many books in one run before. At least this quickly. Alright, let's try... Uh, blue spell book. Oh, get away from me! I just want some peace. Alright, well there's a pair. So why do I keep getting all these weapon options? Am I dragging all of those around with me? That's very strange. Alright, well let's eat the pear. To alleviate our hunger a little bit. And then try this blue spell book. Come on. Too advanced. So we're confused again, but at least we know it's too advanced. Alright, visored helm. I'll take that... Although I can't take this cursed helmet off yet, one day I will be able to. And when I do, I'll put on that good one. Unless, of course, that's cursed as well. Which it will be, knowing my luck. Alright. Gems. Get back, you rat! Okay. Potion. Potion of fireproofing. Fine. Oh, no. I'm encumbered. Alright, better start quaffing some potions. Black potion. Potion of ink. Uh, didn't seem to do anything. Golden Potion. Potion of Mana. Ruby Potion is Potion of Healing. That's good. Silver Potion. Hallucination. Oh no, that's one of my least favourite potions. For obvious reasons. We haven't explored up here yet, so let's go and have a look. Ooh, a chest. Alright, let's see what's in the chest. It's locked. Do you want to try and force it with a weapon or kick it? Let's try and force it. I think that can damage your weapon, but I have a spare anyway. So let's use the morning star. Okay, let's get stuff out. A whistle, don't care. A couple of potions, a scroll, crooked wand. Let's take all of that lot. And let's drink some more potions. Black potion, potion of oil. Sky blue, potion of blindness. Oh god, so now I'm hallucinating and blind. How does that work? It looks like it zoomed me in, so it's not so much blind as extremely short-sighted. Potion of paralysis. Oh, this just gets better and better. Alright. Um, no, I don't want to zap anything. Can I drink a potion? Fireproofing and healing. Okay, so I know what those are. Can I read this scroll? Your vision is too poor to read the scroll. Okay, so that's another effect of blindness. It doesn't just give you short sight. Um, it also means you can't read scrolls. So that's fascinating. Don't know what that thing is, because I'm hallucinating. Let's just kill the blobs. I think I can drink from this fountain thing, actually. Drink from the fountain or dip something into it. Let's drink. You're frozen stiff! Oh my god, no! Oh, this is so awful. Alright. Ugh. No, no, I don't want to do anything with it. What's that? Is that an item? Motionless silver cone. Hmm. What's that? 
That's a shape. I can't tell what it is. Green gem. Oh, fainting from lack of food. Do I have anything? I have a carrot. Yes. Lucky escape. I can see, but I'm still goddamn hallucinating. No, I don't want to dip anything in the fountain. Alright. Potion? No. Um, Alright, let's read these scrolls. Scroll of Enchant Armor. So that's nice. Skull Cup is decursed. So now, what did I tell you? The day would come when I'd be able to take it off. Let's put on the visor helm. Bet it's cursed. Bet it's cursed. No. Alright, let's read. Uh, no, we don't have anything else to read. So let's just move on. I look a bit of a fool in all this gear, actually. Let's take the wand. Don't particularly need a cape. I don't think tartan is really my pattern. I was going to say my colour, but you know what I mean. Alright, let's keep moving. Well, this run is so far going a lot better than last time, or at least lasting a lot longer. Oh god, okay. We're fainting for lack of food every couple of steps. This is a serious problem. Um, I really don't have any food, do I? Alright, let's use one. See if them. See if one of them is a food of... A wand of food, even. Not a food of wand. That would be unpleasant. Choose direction. I don't think there is such a thing as a wand of food. I'm just living in hope. It's not clear what just happened. Fine. Oh, at last I stopped hallucinating. Come on, food. Food. Not gems. You can't eat gems. You can eat gems in some games. What am I thinking of? Morrowind, I think. To no one's great surprise, if you know me personally. I'm always thinking of Morrowind. Okay, get the money. Any meat? No! Can't eat the kobold. Why not? Alright, there's a scroll. I don't want to curse mace. I'll take the identify. Oh, God. Um, Alright, let's use the potion of fireproofing. Just to clear up some space. I'm going to leave the spell book to take the gem. I would take the spell book, but since I'm wrestling with weight already... Come on, kill the thing. There we go. Level up. So, let's go with first aid. Recover health faster. Good stuff. More books, more maces, don't care. Yet yeah, I know books are valuable and they're definitely worth picking up, but it's just... I really don't have the sort of... Uh, the spare strength to carry it all. Oh no, this, this might be the end. What the hell is he? Dwarf. Okay, let's use a wand on him. Crooked wand. Take that! Wand of probing? I don't want to probe him. Um, Ebony wand. Boom! Oh god, it created monsters! Oh, it's all over! It's all over. I can maybe squeeze in one more blast. Wand of death. No? Oh, I can't unwield my cursed create monster wand! Ah! And it's all over. Alright, well, thanks for watching, as always. I hope you got some enjoyment out of seeing the Valkyrie's miserable failure, but also how much it humiliated the knight who collapsed all of a couple of floors into the dungeon last time. Uh, so yes, anyway, thanks for watching, and rejoin me the next time as I continue pressing on into Wazhack. Bye for now.